This place is falling apart. It's caving in. Run. Oh god, run! No! <laughs> What is going on guys and girls? My name is James, or thanks see ya, and welcome back to another Minecraft adventure map let's play. And today we've got quite a cool one, because we are going to be playing the Dangerous West. Yes, this is like a, a Mex- no, not Mexican. <laughs> Why did I say Mexican? This is like a western style cowboy map, and it's gonna be really fun. Um, so yeah, we've kind of spawned into the front here. I'm uh, just gonna do the, you know, the standard stuff to get started here. So uh, it says, can you see the zumble? If so, Yes, we can see the zombies, so it's all good. Uh, we've got a choice of playing on normal or hard. We're just going to play in normal, uh, because I think that's probably for the best. Uh, it says, never switch to peaceful. Do not break blocks unless told. Follow the said path. No hidden chests. Oh, play with maximum brightness. Okay, so this is the book. So we've got here Charles A. Height. We've got ourselves a town key, and we've got ourselves objective one. So let's just take a quick look-see on these, and then we can... Yeah, it looks cool out there. All right, okay, so let's see what this dude has to say. The Dangerous Wayest. Name, Charles A. Height. Uh, sex, male, age 24. Ooh, he's one year older than me. Well, nearly. Uh, profession, construction. Note, wanted for murder, armed and dangerous. $5,000, prize dead or alive. So his story. You were born and raised in a fairly large western city named Marksville. A few months ago, you went out to buy food for your wife and yourself. The trip normally takes a couple of hours, but you soon realised that you did not bring enough money. When you arrived home, you caught your wife cheating on you with another man. God damn! <laughs> every, every, that's not a good start, is it? Everything started moving too fast, and before you knew it, they were both dead, and your revolver had two bullets missing. Right? <laughs> You are wanted, and you had to run for your life. You are now located in a small town called Minerdale. Even though it's so small, it is commonly visited by travellers going from Marksville to Erickson City. Your goal is to remain unnoticed and gain some money to buy yourself a horse and travel far. Alright, so that's the general overview. We are a cowboy, vigilante-style cowboy on the run. And uh, this is objective one here, so it says, objective one, find work for the railroad station, okay? First visit the buildings around the town, they will offer you uh, food, weapons, armor, and other materials, and will need to work, all right, okay, fair enough. The railroad needs to travel through the mountains, so they are in need of excavators. It is a dangerous job, but it pays well. Okay, so let's do the town key in the hopper, blop, and uh, yeah, we're off on our adventure, so this is kind of cool. Ooh. Since Charles A. Height has become the criminal name, you decide to go by the name of Thanksia. <laughs> That's cool. Right, this is the bar. Why are you all particularly... You're drunk. Can't trust you for a second. Okay, so this is like the little town area, this is, I guess. So he said there's no hidden chests around. I don't believe that for a second. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna have a little look around the village here first and see what is going on. But yeah, how is everyone doing? I hope you're all well. Uh, this is cool, man. This is like a little... Ooh, cowboy shanty town. This is Farmer John's home. Uh, what have you got, Farmer John? Have you got anything good for me? No. He says, Howdy, partner. Welcome to my home. What can I do for you? I'm just looking for some food. That'll come at a price. Tell you what, can you catch me a fish? And I'll give you loads of bread. I have a fishing rod in the chest near the house. Just use it, okay. <laughs> That's cool. Alright, okay, so we've got to do some fishing. And then in return, he will give us some bed. Bread. Weird. Weird looking beds, which aren't actually beds. Alright, okay, so... Where do we fish? There is no pond here! Or is there? Is, 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 what?! <laughs> okay, so I haven't found it. Surely I don't fish in this crucible. <laughs> is that even possible? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know. Why is it not working? Find me a fish! Ah, oh, just kidding. Alright, okay, let's... Uh, I, I guess there'd be a, a lake or something around here? I don't know. All right. Oh, there's a lake down there. Okay, right. So that's that's that dude's house. So he's gonna give us some bread. This is the city hall. Hmm. Anything in here? I don't know. Let's check out upstairs. Ooh, lovely jacket, sir. This is Mayor Leonard. I like you already. You've got some. You've got some swagger about you. All right. So this guy will give me one emerald for two bottles of enchanting. But there's no like. Uh, there's no book or anything. So I'm guessing maybe that's something we do in the past. So I'm gonna. Close this up so he's safe. Uh, Alright, there's a little lake here. Let's find some fish. Dun, 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 
So yeah, in other words, in, in other words, in other news, um, I'm doing this let's play now because uh, we've actually finished uh, the adventure map, which is uh, Rise of the Pigmen, which is Rise of the Pigmen 1. So uh, yeah, thank you so much for everyone who watched that and enjoyed that. It kind of really, really inspired me to want to do some more uh, like adventure maps and stuff because I don't know, I just, I really enjoy these, and I think personally not enough people do them on YouTube anymore. Uh, they used to be like super popular, why won't you find me a fish? Uh, they used to be like super popular, but can I even fish in this? I should be able to. Um, but uh, yeah, I think it's, they're really fun, and you can kind of get involved in the comments, and you can you know join in with the experience, and I really like them. Um, but yeah, in other news as well, I actually talked to the developer of the Rise of the Pigman map, and uh, he's, he's doing a second one, in case you didn't know. Um, so yeah, if you've got any suggestions as to what you'd like to see, so if you've seen the first series, why wouldn't you find any fish? Uh, if you've seen the first series and uh, you have any suggestions as to what you'd like to see, what you thought worked about the first one, uh, leave them in the comment section below, that'd be really cool. Uh, then maybe we could have some influence as to how the map plays, I think that's pretty damn exciting. Um, but yeah, very, very cool. So I'm going to be playing Rise of the Pigmen 2 when it comes out, but I thought I'd do some other stuff in the meantime. Oh, screw this. There's no fish around here, they're all dead. Mm, all right, never mind. Bank of the people. You got a neckerchief. If you want money, work at the railroad. If you want a weapon, go to the police next door. Fair enough. What is downstairs? Employee only. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough, skis. Um, right. General store. Hmm. You can't afford this. Don't dare steal. I got my eyes on you. This is Jenny. Jenny. You look very manly for a Jenny, I've got to say. Why they, Why have they not got female villages yet? It wouldn't make so much sense. Plant pots, plant pots. Oh, I want to steal that so badly. Um, should I steal that? What would happen if I stole that? Nothing. <laughs> I'm a rogue vigilante here, man. I've got to steal. I've got to lie, I've got to cheat, and I've got to steal. <laughs> because because this, is, this is what vigilantes do. You know, I'm a wanted man. I, I can't, I can't, uh, you know, I can't be going around being good. I'm going to take some coal, just in case. I'll take a little bit. I don't want to be too, too greedy, but, you know, the thing is, your security is terrible. And I'm going to have to exploit that because I'm a hungry man. Haha, <laughs> screw you. Alright, what else have we got here? We have the Sheriff's Department. Uh, it says, bring back Bandit Brain from Barber to keep the sword. <gasps> An iron sword. Unbreaking enchantment. Level 100. I think that's probably like level 1. Oh god, that's a, tra oh, it's a trap chest. Okay, so we need to find some brains. And this is Sheriff McGee. Are you drunk? Maybe. And this guy will give us an iron sword for uh, that. Okay, fair enough skis. Fair enough skis. Okay, so uh, we've got a little bit of a side quest there. We need to go to the barbers and find some zombie brains. Oh, this is the barbers. Oh god! <laughs> it's a bandit! <laughs> <laughs> this is Bandito. No, 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 no. Oh, he's got a gun. Why won't you die? Why won't, why won't you die? What the hell? Why won't you die? Oh. Let me try that again. Oh, did you see the, the cool textures? It's like a resource pack that you can use, and it would give, like, the, the bandits and stuff guns and, like, ponchos. Look at this guy. <laughs> oh, and now he's dead. Okay, so this stone sword is useless, so hopefully what I'm going to do here is I've got... A bandit brain, an arrow, and a bone. I think the arrows are actually bullets, so I'm gonna keep those. Uh, and let's go and let's go and get that cool sword. That's a good start. Okay. Uh, so blop, and I missed. Come on. There we go. You took a bad criminal off the street, so enjoy your new. I'm a bad criminal. Say, you sound familiar. I bet it's nothing. Carry on. Oh god, that's the sheriff. He spotted me. We need to go. We need to leave now. All right, okay, we're out. We're out. So yeah, okay, so we, we've done a good deed, although we're not really, we're not really even, because we have brutally killed our wife and illicit lover, so, yeah. This is Manager Rick. Hmm, you got a nice jacket on as well. Okay, so what is this? Oh, God. Oh, there we go, we're cool. So I'm kind of just scavenging around here, seeing what we can find. Um, hopefully we should find some good stuff. Yeah, I, the reason why I played this map, because one, I, I really like sort of cowboy-themed things. Uh, in general, and be like it reminded me of the Mysterious East, which was another Let's Play that we've already done. Uh, so I don't think it's by the same guy, but, uh, ooh. What is this? Oh, God. Guns with James. Ah, good name. Sorry, kid, but there's no time to talk. Hostages are being held in the hospital. Listen, take a gun in the chest at the front of the room and head over there. 
What does that say? If you do this, you can keep the gun. I'll help you around the time. Okay. Sorry about my terrible cowboy accent. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we can get a gun. <gasps> da, da, da. So we've got a revolver, power one and infinity one. So we can pretty much use that indefinitely now we've got infinity. And we've got some decent armor, so I'll probably take off this armor that I've stolen. And I'll use this unbreaking. That's pretty sweet. Uh, six hearts, bandit heart. Interesting. Don't really know. Okay, so I guess if I find some more bandit hearts. Break the glowstone if hearts are missing. What hearts? I am so confused. Should I should I break it? Bandit hearts. Uh, okay, I shouldn't have broke that. Okay, we'll, we'll leave that for now. We'll leave that for now. Uh, what's in here? Wool? Oop. The bar is upstairs. What would you like to order? Oh, I can't afford fancy drinks. <laughs> right, so there's some shears in here. It says, well, I'll give you a free drink if you break into Farmer John's barn and get me some wool. <laughs> All right, okay, that sounds good. Let's do that. Uh, so we need to steal this dude some wool. Where are you? Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. All right. Oh, God, look at the drinks. They're so cool looking. Scotch. Scotch. Then whiskey. Okay. Very good. Very good. Scotch and whiskey. Uh, all right, so let's go. Where's that guy's? Where's that dude's barn? Is that the barn, or is that the barn? I thought this was the barn. I don't think that. Were there any sheep's in there? I can't remember. Farmer John's barn. Ah, hey. <laughs> where's there a gate? There it is. Stealing all your wools. I'm climbing in your hay barn. I'm stealing your sheepies up. All right, there we go. So I got yourself some wool. You need some carpet. That's fair enough. Okay, let's do this. See, so, yeah, I kind of want to do like them little bits and pieces here to sort of get some get some gear together. Um, all right, let's let's run in here. Uh, oh, you can keep your shears. You can have these. I don't want them. And uh, we can stick the wool in here. Blup. Oh God, yes. Thank you kindly. Enjoy the drinks. So we've got a potion of swiftness, a potion of regen, and a potion of healing, which is very very cool. So let's stick those in there for now. All right, let's carry on. See what else we can find. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, this is a hospital. There's a stick up. Let me get my gun out. Please, ban. Oh. Please help, bandits. Okay. Oh god, there's a lot of bandits. Oh, what a <laughs> did you see my? That was my first shot. It was awful. Um. Bang. He dead. Oh god, now they're all fighting. See, there's no justice amongst criminals. I've got to say it. <laughs> Alright, okay. So there's quite a few of them up here. But... Oh god. Oh god, we've been breached. We've been breached. Die. Yes. Oh god, they're shooting each other. We've got ourselves a Mexican standoff here, boys. Yes. Ooh. Okay, there we go. Happy days. Alright, so we've got some brains there. Let's... What are these guys. Anything good? No, just some stuff. Just some stuff. Right, so this is the hospital. We hazarded the hospital. Oh god, get down the stairs. We got some brains as well. There you go, Lise. Nurse Lisa. Happy days. So okay, so we've we've, we've finished the hospital. Now how many brains have we got? Oh we got five. I need six. Six hearts. Bandit heart. Which one is in there? I think I need one more. I need one more, don't I, James? Yes. Okay, very good, very good. So Cleared out the hospital. Now, what we need to do is... Ah, there's more. Church of the Morning. Praise the Lord and Saviour. Who are you? Reverend Edward. Okay, so can we... These are already enchanted. I don't really need to... I don't really need to do anything in here just yet. Okay, so what else can we find? We need to find the rail... Rail... Rail road. <laughs> so that's one of the places we need to go. Um, so I think that was... Where was that? That was... I can kind of hear a railway, tr a railway track, a railway track. So, ooh, we can go up here. Hmm. Interesting. It was that thing. I had it. I swear I had it. Arrival in. I've already been in there. I've already been in there. <laughs> All right. Enough of the shenanigans. Where the? I swear I can't remember which building it was in. It was in one of these. What a city hall. Was it? No. Okay, okay, okay. So, the name of the game is to get ourselves a horse, 
buy ourselves a horse even, um, but we need to go to the railway to do that, and I've completely forgotten where the railway is. Um, oh, what's that? Oh, it's the saloon! Oh, I like that, he's done it in like uh, writing, very cool. Alright, so let's, uh, let's take a quick look-see around here, see if there's anything, anything good. Nope. Right, 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 right. Oh, hang on, wait, where was this? Oh, I remember it, because it was... Wasn't it underground or something? I can't remember. Hmm. Right. So we need to find... We're still looking. I, I swear it was... I can hear it. It's underneath here somewhere. So let's just try all of them. Barbershop. Was it under here? No, it was not. Okay. Um. Was it under the general store? Nope. Okay. Was it under the sheriff's department? No! <laughs> Completely forgot where it is. Was it under the bag of many people? Yes, it was. Ah, yeah, of course. How do I get in? There's no buttons. Employee only. I am very confused. Do you give me, like, something? No? Okay. Um... Right, I've I have no idea. Let's let's go and talk to some people, and uh, yeah, I will try and figure it out. Okay, I figured it out. Um, it's actually remember when we broke that piece of glowstone? We were actually supposed to get six um, uh, brains from the hospital, but we only got five. So that chest is there just in case that doesn't work, and then we can use those to get that. So that's kind of cool. But I'm just doing some fishing here again because um, it's kind of I want to get some more food. So ah, I missed it. Uh, so I got myself a puffer fish. Look at him, how we're happy and stuff in the in the in the bar. Uh, but yeah, let's just grab one more fish and then we'll give the dude. Uh, I think we only need. I don't know how many we need actually. Hopefully, we only need a couple. Uh, but I'll show you what happens in a second. Let's just come on, one more fish. Come on, don't be stingy. <laughs> come on. Oh God, yes, fish. Okay, so. Let's go and give this dude some fish, let's get some food, and then I'll show you uh, what we do. Um, so... Was this was this guy, wasn't it? Yeah, okay, so this is Father John, so let's chuck a raw fish in here. Yay! So we've got some bread! Can we do it again with the puffer fish? No! <laughs> okay, so fair enough. But we got some food, that's kind of cool. So if we go this way, we did actually liberate some melons. Well, we are a real cowboy after all, so, you know, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. Um, yeah, let's eat these. Right. So, I'm guessing because of the, the drop rates and stuff for the actual skulls, uh, or the brains even, we needed six, so we didn't get six. So, we can actually legitimately take one of these. So, let's go bandit heart. No, not brains, hearts. Yeah, that was it. So, we've already chucked five in here. Let's chuck the next one. There we go. So, it says, Gunsmith James, you have saved a lot of sick people today. As I promised, you got a job at the railroads, railroad station. Ah, okay. Once uh, you finish taking a look at uh, the town, press the button inside the shop. What button? It's this button. There is no button. What? Oh, outside the shop. My bad. Okay, so this is please read notes before pressing. I really like the use of sort of commands and command blocks and stuff in here. Very, very cool. Alright, so this is the important notice. So it says, make sure you visit Farmer John for food, the sheriff for a sword, and the saloon for some potions before pressing the button. Once you press the button, you will not be able to return. Alright, so we've done that. Uh, what do we not need? Let's just take all that for now just in case. And boom! Oh god, it's getting serious. Welcome to thanks uh, welcome thanks here to the construction site at the railroad station company. Worker Robert next to me will help you or get around and teach you your techniques. Right. I'm here to help, but I'm sure sure you've seen your face somewhere. Have we met? I'm not wanted on all the posters. Mm hmm I have a similar face, but I don't recognize you. <laughs> You're that boy with a bounty of five thousand Oh god, it's gonna kill me! <laughs> no! No! Kill him! Kill him with fire! <laughs> Yes. Oh god. You better start ban dancing, boy. Rabbit, stop. This, oh god. Alright, okay. This place isn't a stable. It'll start shaking. This place is falling apart. It's caving in. Run. Oh god, run! No! <laughs> no, I should have ran! Why did I not run? Oh. <laughs> oh. We've had a cave in, boys. Boys and girls. We we've. Ooh. Damn it. I'm alive! I can't believe it! I survived, but I still need to find a way out. Oh, so I'm not actually dead. Well, I am kind of dead, but I'm not dead. The only way uh, I would be able to find another way out 
would be by going in deeper. Okay, so that's deeper. But I don't particularly want to go down there. But I, I have to. Okay, so let's... 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 Oh, don't fall. Yes! Oh, damn it! Oh, 